Hey everyone, Sean Tierney here from the Automation Blog, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to use Emulate 500, the free emulator from Rockwell, inside of Factory Talk View Studio. So let's go ahead and get started. You can see I have links here. I have uh, Emulate and I have RS Logic's Micro Starter Lite, all free downloads from uh, Rockwell. If you want to know how to download those, check out episode six of season three where I cover that. But here inside of RS Links Classic Lite, I'm going to go to DDE OPC and I'm going to go to Topic Configuration. There it is right there. And here I'm going to browse from my emulated PLC and I'm going to create a new topic here and I'm going to do EMU 1100. Okay, and uh, I'll click on Apply. And now we have a new RS Links Classic Lite topic. So now that I'm done with that, let me go ahead and click on done. And now I'll just go ahead and minimize all these guys here. And we'll come over to Factory Talk View Studio. I'm in Machine Edition. And I've shrunk up my project here. And uh, I'm going to right click here on the application. And I am going to select Add New Server. And I'm going to click OPC Data Server. Okay. And here, I'm going to go ahead and give it a name. I'm going to call it RS Links Classic. And then, let's see here. Let me go ahead and browse for it. There it is, RS Links OPC Server. Click on OK. There it is. I'm going to hit Apply and OK. And now, let me go ahead and add a numeric display here on the screen. Double click on it. We'll go to Connections. We'll go to Tag. I'll right click and Refresh All. And then we will go to EMU 1100. We'll go online. And let's go look for N70. Excellent. So I'll hit OK. And I'll, let me go ahead and uh, save my screen as untitled. I'll play test it. And then I have a zero. Now let's go back to RS Logics here. OK. And we will go into the integer file. And let's move this over here. And I'll type in a value of, let's put in seven. And we should see that show up right here. And that's how easy it is to use RS Links Classic and RS Emulate, the free emulator, PLC emulator, with Factory Talk View Studio. Now, the only thing that really could stop this from working is if you didn't have a license for Factory Talk View. If you have a license for Factory Talk View, then it's going to go ahead, even if it's a temporary license, it should activate RS Links Classic to be able to do this. However, if you don't have a uh, license for Factory Talk View and you don't have a license for RS Links, then uh, OPC won't be enabled. And with that, that's the end of this uh, video. If you'd like to help me make more videos, check out my Patreon over at www.patreon.com forward slash automation. And if you'd like to learn everything you need to know to program the Panel View Plus and using uh, View Machine Edition, then check out my course over at theautomationschool.com. It's called PVP Basics. And until next time, peace.